one piece of advice I would add there too is if you're gonna, um, anytime you're transferring through a hose into another empty container, um, you're gonna have the potential for residue in that line. And that's even more true when it's highly concentrated and dying to crystallize like this. So what you're gonna wanna do is probably fill with just a little bit less solvent than you need so that after you're finished draining into the diamond miner, you can follow it with some clean solvent right behind that to just flush your hose out, flush that valve out, and make sure that you know you don't have a completely clogged hose full of powder coming up right behind you. So you would want to kind of recover a little extra, but then add some solvent behind. It helps if that solvent that comes in behind is warmer. And if it's not easy for you to do that, you can always kind of leave it in the hose for a little while and then come back and drain it. But definitely try to follow through behind it with some solvent after you first fill it, just to make sure that that line is cleared out. Because even like a 24 inch kind of short 3 8 hose can hold a lot of oil in it if you let it get clogged up. And it won't be easy to get out once it's hard crystal. Yeah, so you pretty much have to throw the hose out. Yeah. 